Yeah, 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 we back with my man right here, Craig Mack, chilling, bad boy entertainment artist, Craig Mack. Yo, let me just ask you another question, bro. I mean, it's been beating their head so many times how uh, rappers instigate violence and so forth and so on. The incident at the record shop, I mean, just, just elaborate on that for the people. It's just one last time, just dead at once and for all. I went outside to go shake a hand and <laughs> sign an autograph and I got arrested. That is what happened <laughs> in a nutshell. In a nutshell. And we're going to end it in that same nutshell. There is no anger. There is no disrespect. No, no pun intended. Not for what, man? Come on. So it's always called about, so, you, know, you know, blacks always looking for something. You know what I'm saying? We need to stop looking at the Joneses and everybody else's plights and trials and tribulations and get down with ourselves and get the devil out of our brain and get down to business. Free your mind. Just do your thing. Word up. Blacklicious Fat Funk Flav. Yo, another question. I mean, do you, are, are you sick and tired of people, you know, like getting mad, excited when they see, oh, wow, Craig Max uh, following the, the path of God and so forth? I mean, you get upset about that? I mean, like, why can't you follow the path of God? You know what I mean? Nah, I don't get upset about it at all. If anything, the people who disagree with the fact that I'm trying to follow the path of God, I feel bad for them. I weep for, I pray for, you know what I'm saying? That's serious. That's nothing to play around with. And it's nothing to sit there and say, well, it's just a cute topic for rap because it's serious. All right? And, um, you know, that's my choice in life, you know what I'm saying? And you have your choice in life. But I felt that the way rap is going now and everything else, the way everybody's out here yelling and cursing, that it wasn't even presented as an option. God. You understand what I'm saying? At least give the people an option. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got, if you don't want to believe in God, then cool, but at least know about God. You know what I'm saying? Or know a little something about God, and then say you're not going to believe in God. And then, then say you're going to choose your, your choice. You know what I'm saying? But see, right now, everything is being turned away from God, and, and we are at a stage now where we don't even acknowledge it or, or there it's being taken away from us in the media and in every other walk of life, you know what I'm saying, in school and in television and everything else, you know what I'm saying, so I feel it's important that some kind of way that the message of God is being spread. We have, we have the largest system of communications, we're always talking about black people need, need, need. We have the largest communication system in this country is our music and what we do is when we talk about things we talk about guns and treating girls how we're gonna treat them and everything else and selling drugs and everything else you know what I'm saying and I understand you know what I'm saying because I ain't just all of a sudden pop on the earth with loot you know what I'm saying <laughs> and I all of a sudden just you know what I'm saying was all of a sudden just Craig Mack this, 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 this person I am now running around doing shows and stuff you know what I'm saying we was out there too but what I'm saying is like this, if you're going to talk about how bad it is and everything else and talk about what you used to have to do and what you do and everything else, you know what I'm saying, come with a solution. You know what I'm saying? Have a little something at the end of the song that will talk about a solution for the problem that you're talking about. You know what I'm saying? You know, don't just leave us up in the air like that. That's all I'm saying. And if you ain't got nothing good to say, don't say nothing at all. So I stick to my freestyle rhymes and I do my thing. You know what I'm no saying? Doubt. No doubt. Well, one more thing before before I go, let me ask you. Um, so what what's in the future for Craig Mack? I mean, what's what's up with the next album? What's the name of it? What's the title? I mean, the people Mo out there starting. Mo crazy fat joints. You know what I'm saying? Once again, we gonna come with something that you ain't heard before. You know what I'm saying? That's a guarantee. You know what I'm saying? And um, we working on we get ready to start working on the album in about another week or so. Right now, I'm just listening to a whole bunch of tracks and stuff like that, fiddling around with my my stuff at home. You know what I'm saying? Getting all the ideas and everything together, putting all the blueprints together. You have, you have in mind who you want to put on your album with you? Or are you I just going to just. Yet, you know what I'm saying? Because, see, I don't do that out of manufacturing. I, you know what I'm saying? If I got love for a brother, then. You just going to. Right. You know what I'm saying? It could be somebody from around my way, could be another artist. You know what I'm saying? If it's dope. And if it's something I love and it's something we doing, something that's going to inspire me to give something to the people, then it's going to be right and it's going to be on. Yeah, no doubt.
pleasure having this talk with you, bro. Thanks a lot, bro. You know what I'm saying? This is not an interview. The party scene, we don't interview artists. We conversate with artists. You know what I'm saying? This was a conversation going on. No doubt. And yo, we're going to bring it back. You know what I'm saying? My man Craig Mack going to flip a little freestyle for the heads out there that's thirsty. Stay tuned.